The wine is ready. Your sister will pour. When they're all seated, you give the signal. Remember, no matter how much they might provoke you, we must let them think they've won. That's them. Here we go. Gwyn! Clever. Send the girl first. Don't let her play with your head, little brother. Lady Forrester. My apologies for arriving unannounced. I was hoping I might have a word in private with Asher. I think we can agree these are not ideal circumstances. Agreed. But these are the circumstances we find ourselves in. I know how you must feel, Asher. What your family has suffered, it's unimaginable. Which is why the bloodshed must stop. I agreed to your father's terms, didn't I? You did. But I know you, Asher. You're not the one to roll over so easily. You don't like being pushed into a corner. It's not in your nature. Things are different now. I'm different now. But you have nothing to worry about. You are always a terrible liar. You have to understand. I've risked everything to bring peace between our houses. To meet with Roderick in secret. To tell him of the traitor within these very walls. To make sure no harm came to Ryan as our ward. All while persuading my father the bloodshed would end if we were to wed. I have no ulterior motive. No hidden agenda. Just peace. Once and for all. I trust you, Gwyn. I know you've lost a lot, and... And I'm sorry. But things will get better. Truth be told, my father's scared of you. Is he? With Roderick, he knew who and what he was dealing with. But you, he thinks you're dangerous. You proved as much when you attacked his men. They came after us. I know. And that's all in the past now, I promise. We can make this work, Asher. This is our one chance. Together we can control the future of our houses. Just promise me, when my father and brother walk through that door, nothing will happen that could threaten that future. Our future. I need your assurance. Nothing will happen. I promise. Nothing will happen. Thank you, Asher. I knew I could trust you. Sorry to intrude, my lord. But Lady Forrester is in need of your help. Of course. I should go. Thank you, Asher. What help does my mother need? Sorry, my lord. It's all that came to mind. But we have everything in place. How should we proceed? Ready the poison. Consider it done, my lord. Ah. Elisa, I'm sorry it's come to this. But at least it's done. Where's my son? Right to it, then. Mother! Huh. Oh, my baby. Oh, oh my baby. Ah! Enough blubbering. You can have him back when we've hammered out the details of your surrender. Ah! Lord Whitehill. Asher, now who'd ever have imagined this? You welcoming me into your hall to drink your wine and call me father. <laughs> I thought I'd seen the last of you when Gregor shipped you off to the other side of the bloody world. Let's get on with this. Watch the hurry. We'll be spending the rest of our lives together as family. 
You're not my family, Lord. And you'll never be mine! If I wasn't so bloody soft-hearted... Father, please. I know this isn't easy, but it's right. Would you like to sit down, Lord Whitehill? Aye. And get me something to drink. I'm bloody parched. Talia, why don't you fetch the wine for his lordship? We thought you'd like to sit here, Lord Whitehill. I'll sit there. Thank you very much. In the Lord's chair. It's not like your father wanted your worthless ass in it. Our hall is yours, Lord Whitehill. Make yourself comfortable. You're damn right it's my bloody hall. But you're too ready to give it over. Cocky one moment, licking my ass the next. Your false smiles don't fool me, Forrester. Calm down, Father. Asha's just showing you the respect you deserve. So, Lord Forrester. You made your ways a soul sword out there, did you? Eh, a little rape, a little murder. Anything for the right price. And your family must be so proud. And all those bed slaves a cell sword must enjoy across a narrow sea. Ah, oh, I can't imagine how my sister will be able to please you. I think we're ready for the wine, Talia. Aye, wine. Enough bloody nattering! Sit the hell down, Griffin, let's drink! A toast! We should make a toast. Aye! What shall we toast to? Come on then, let's hear it! To Gwyn, my betrothed. Without you, none of this could happen. To win. To win. To win. No, no, no. This isn't right. You first, then me. In the way of the North. Come, Forrester. Let's drink together as lords of our houses. Let me. Let it be you and I who seal this bond. For our houses. For our children. No! <gasps> Fucking foresters! I knew you weren't to be trusted! They tried to poison him! Asha, how could you? I showed mercy! I gave you my daughter! <laughs> <laughs> Win! 
It could have been so different. But you destroyed everything. Goodbye, Asha. Oh! <laughs>